Back with you know who, and we're going to be working her on the off leash. You do have to use quite a bit of nick with her. She's not super sensitive. And Troy, I'm going to have a few little tips for you in here. What I want you guys to remember when we're starting the off leash, it's falling under the umbrella of move in my direction. So if you get in a bind, you're always going to fall back on your recall. Remember, we practiced that from day one. That's why we can get them off leash because they understand there's no away. So I've got this sound box collar on. Remember that buzzing indicates the pager. The shorter chirping sound is the nick, and that's the replacement for if you had a choke chain on there and you were kind of trying to pop the collar. Oh, she's a little animated thing, this one. Good. She's got a new little friend, and she's running him all over the yard like a mania. So we might bring him out for a distraction later. All right, so but what I'm... What, what I want you guys to remember is we only have three basic behaviors here. So heel is an extension of the coming. So I'm going to use the dog's name. I'm going to start my pager slightly before. Micah! Come on. Come on. Heel. She starts to go ahead. Heel. Wonderful.